Welcome, in front of me is a Xiaomi Redmi Note 9S and today I'll show you how to enable the Do Not Disturb mode. So to get started, let's pull down the notification panel and look for the Do Not Disturb mode toggle. So for me it looks like it's on the second page and on here it's called DND, basically just a shortcut for Do Not Disturb. Now before you tap on it to enable it, you want to hold that option and it will take us to the settings where you can customize how it works. So number one, have the regular, which is the silent mode. Regular is just it being turned off. Then you have the silent, which will uh, make everything silent. Calls, notifications will be silent, as you can see right here. And then the do not disturb mode. So silence, sound, and turn off vibration, except for the alarms. So you can choose whichever one you want. When you tap on the do not disturb mode, it gives a couple additional options. So incoming calls, you can choose what happens with the incoming calls. And from here, I can allow incoming calls during the do not disturb mode from anyone, which defeats the purpose of it. It's basically everybody can call you then. From contacts only, uh, stared contacts only, which is just your favorites, and then none, which no one can call you. So choose whichever one you want. And also you have the option below. So uh, notify about repeated callers. So basically, if someone calls you twice within a 15 minute period, they will actually be able to reach you the second time around, um, completely bypassing basically this option. So even though right now it's set to none, uh, if you have that on, it will kind of well, disregard uh, the option above, assuming they call you twice within a 15 minute period. Now, this is a good option to have for some kind of emergency, usually people call more than twice within that 15 minute period if they really need something from you because they have an emergency. And then you have also some notification settings, so you can allow them or not. And then the last option is the schedule. So you can go in here and, for instance, set your own schedule by tapping on add. And name it whatever you want. You can keep it, timer two, whatever, it doesn't really matter. Days of the week. So you have a couple of presets like every day, uh, weeknights, uh, weekend, and custom, which will allow you to choose whichever one you want specifically, a day of the week. So I'm gonna create a work one with one additional day during the week. So let's disable Saturday and Sunday, or maybe Wednesday. And let's tap on OK. And from here, start from, as a work one, I'm gonna start from nine. There we go. Oops, I set it to eight, whatever it can stay like that. So let's set it to four. go step on okay and then silent mode do not disturb uh, that's what it would go with so let's keep it tap on check mark and it automatically turns on because it's right now and the time that it's supposed to be enabled in so you can leave it and with this being set up it will turn on and off automatically every single day from 8 to 4 and if you want to disable it manually when it's enabled because it's well right now work time you can simply tap on it to well, disable it and apart from it turning on and off automatically you can still interact with it manually by tapping on it to enable it at any time you want so that's how you enable disable and also set up the do not disturb mode and if you found this video helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching mm -hmm.